welcome back to another episode of Dastardly Danny here, and I am fucking dying. Oh. I'm going up against Flowey. Bastard. Bastard from hell. Bastard. I cried real tears. I cried real tears. And now it's time for him to cry real tears. Ah. Let's, okay, let's go. Let's. Pathetic. Now you're really gonna die. I've been dying this whole time. You wanna go? Cause I'd love to go. I don't know how I'm supposed to avoid any of you. Out into it. Give me help. All right, cool, 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 cool. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Ah, good fucking Jesus Christ. Thank you, everybody. All right, I'm getting hit a lot. That's right, you son of a bitch! My friends are gonna come and they're gonna kick your ass. Okay, that's okay.
The souls! What are they doing? I'm recording right now, and it's something very... <laughs> ah, fuck! Hey, man! I can't go through all of that again. He killed my dad. What type of human would I be if I fought you? What are you doing? Do you really think I've learned anything from this? No. Sparing me won't change anything. Killing me is the only way to end this. I had to kill my dad. Well, you killed him for me, but if you let me live, I'll come back. Guys, guys, I don't... I'll kill you. I'll kill everyone. I'll kill everyone you love! Come on, Flowey. Come on, Flowey. Why are you being so nice to me? I am a good person. I can't understand. I can't understand. I just can't understand. He ran off. Pardon me? That's the end? Pardon me? Pardon? Pardon? <laughs> Okay, well. I defeated two... I defeated two bosses in one day? That's not me. That's not me at all. No? What? Uh, my phone? Oh! <laughs> Sans! Is anyone there? Well, I'll just leave a message. So it's been a while. The queen returned and now ruling over the underground. She's instated a new policy. All the humans who fought here will be treated not as enemies, but as friends. It's probably for the best anyway. No human souls the king gathered seem to have disappeared. So, that plan ain't happening anytime soon. Even though people are heartbroken over the king and things are looking grim for our freedom. The queen's trying her best not to let us give up hope. So, uh, hey, if we're not giving up down here, don't give up wherever you are, okay? Who knows how long it will take, but we will get out of here. Sons, who are you talking to? <laughs> oh, nobody. What? Nobody? Can I talk to them too? Here, knock yourself out. Wait a second. I recognize this number. Attention, human! I, the great Papyrus, Papyrus, <laughs> am now captain of the Royal Guard. It's everything I've ever dreamed of, except instead of fighting, we just water flowers. So that's ever so slightly different. 
We're helping Dr. Alphys with her research. She's gonna find a way to get us out of here. Mondine is helping her too. Though, to be honest, her method of helping seems kind of explosion-inducing. But I think Alphys likes having her around. Uh-oh! Hey! What are you up to, punk? Yak! Please don't nuke the phone. Hey, who's in charge here? Me. <laughs> oh, yeah, <laughs> that's right. I quit my job as leader of the Royal Guard. Actually, since we won't be fighting anymore, the Royal Guard is totally disbanded. There's uh, only one member now, <laughs> but he's extremely good. Yeah, he is. Come here. Please don't noogie the skeleton. Anyways, now I'm working as Alpha's lab assistant. We're gonna find a way out of this dump once and for all. Oh yeah, and I'm a gym teacher at the Queen's New School. Did you know I could bench press seven children? <laughs> awesome, right? Hey, I'm sorry about what happened with Ascorn. You were just doing what you had to. It's not your fault he... Darn it, I missed the big guy. Come on, Don Dine. Snap out of it! I guess I'll tell you how Alphys is doing. Well, she's the same as ever. Maybe a little bit more reclusive than normal. It seems like something is really bothering her, but she can get through it. I'm there supporting her. That's what friends are for, right? Hey, wherever you are, I hope it's better than here. It took a lot of sacrifice for you to get there. So wherever you are, you have to try to be happy, okay? For our sakes. We'll feel better knowing our trouble was worth it. We're all with you, everyone is. Even the queen. <laughs> hey, wait a second. Toriel, do you wanna? She says she's busy. But if she knew who we were talking to, we wouldn't get the phone back at least a few hours. You have the mercy to spare. We have the mercy to spare you from her. Pick call back any time, okay? She'd love to talk. Oh, whoops. This thing is almost out of battery, so I hate to cut this short. But seeing you, okay, buddy. Bye bye for now. See ya, punk. Where am I? Why? Why did you let me go? Don't you realize that being nice just makes you get hurt? Look at yourself. You made all these great friends, but now you'll probably never see them again. Not to mention how much they've been set back by you. It hurts, doesn't it? A lot, yeah. It hurts a lot. And if you had just gone through without caring about anyone, you wouldn't have to feel bad now. So I don't get it. If you really did the right thing, why did things still end up like this? Is life really that unfair? Uh, yeah, it is. <laughs> Welcome to life, Wowie! Say, what if I told you I knew some way to get a better ending? You have to load your save file, and well, in the meantime, why don't you go see Dr. Alphys? It seems like you could have been better friends. Who knows? Maybe she's got the key to your happiness. See you soon. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna go see office. Back at the hotel. I wonder if all the mo Hey! Uh, this is Undyne. Shut up, Papyrus. This is your idea. Human, you have to deliver something for me. Please? I meant Snowden's in front of Papyrus's. See ya, punk! Care for a ride? Oh my god, my voice broke right there. Yes. Let's go! Off to Snowden! Why don't you sing with me? Tra la la, I did. Hmm. 
I made it to Snowden. Uh, I need you to deliver this letter to Dr. Alphys. Huh? Why don't I do it myself? Well, um, <laughs> it's kind of personal, but we're friends, so uh, I'll tell you. Hotland sucks. I don't want to have to go over there. So here you go. <laughs> That's right, she melts. Oh, and if you read it, I'll kill you. <laughs> Thanks so much, you're the best. Oh my god, the letter's not to Papyrus. <laughs> Fine, you want a letter? I'll give you a letter. You get a knife. Oh no! What's the F for? Friendship. Oh! Alright, so I just noticed that my thing is low on battery out of nowhere because it was full just a second ago. Dick. So I'm gonna take this to Undying. Come on, just. Yes! Take me to the hotlands. Sweet. So, in case this cuts off, it's okay because I'm still recording the thing. So, the only thing is that you won't get any expressions, which is fine. It's totally fine. Ah, she says something and I skip through it like a jerk. Alright, let's go. My audio might also go kaput because I used the audio from my camera. No! How am I supposed to get in? Alright, I'll go the long way around. Why don't we all go over and watch anime? Anime? Isn't that kind of a cartoon for small children? Oh my god! Anime isn't for kids! It's emotional! Is... Grrrr? An emotion? Yeah, cause it's how I'm feeling right now. Okay, cool. Should I slide it? Oh no, it's not. Is that another letter? I don't want to open it. Uh, should I make her voice? No. I can't do this. I'll read this one. Um. It's shut kind of strongly, isn't it? Wait a sec. Hey, if this is a joke, it's... Oh my god. Did you write this letter? It wasn't signed, so I had no idea who could have... Oh my god, oh no. That's adorable. And I had no idea you, um, wrote that way. It's surprising, too, after all the gross stuff I did. I don't really deserve to be forgiven, much less this. And so passionately, too. Oh god. <laughs> You know what? Okay, I'll do it. It's the least I could do to make it up to you. Yeah, let's go on a date. I'm dying. <laughs> Dating start! Alright. Cool. I'll take this up on the next episode. Thank you so much for watching, and uh, yeah. Things are looking up.